On this episode of Inspiration Nation, we are back at it on our Conquest track car build. And we have already gotten it stripped all the way down to a bare shell, and now it's time to start the fun process of stitch welding the entire chassis. We've already gotten rid of the sound deadening. There's still some residual sound deadening we're gonna have to get rid of, but now we're on the detidious part of getting rid of all the factory seam sealer and cleaning all of the seams up so that when we weld, we get an uncontaminated weld. Now the first thing we gotta do is get rid of all the seam sealer on the seams that we're gonna be doing. And how I'm doing that is a small little wire wheel on a die grinder. It's a messy job and you gotta watch out for those little little wires flinging off at you, but it gets the job done. And then you'll come back in and uh, clean up the area so you can get it to bare metal and get some spot welds or stitch welds in there. Wes, cue the time lapse. <laughs> Okay, so the wire wheel works, don't get me wrong, and it gets really clean, but it takes forever when it's the big clumpy bead of seam sealer. Yeah, it takes forever. So we're gonna try to hit it with a little bit of the uh, propane torch, just to heat it up and see if it'll come out a little bit easier. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have dropped that like that. <laughs> We'll have to try that propane at a later date. I am completely out. So, uh, back to the grind, so to speak. Now that we've got all the seams cleaned up, it's time to start stitch welding. I'm not even gonna lie, I don't have all the seams cleaned up right now, but I got tired of raking seam sealer, so now it's time to do some welding. most of the passenger side uh, seat area stitch welded. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. And we're basically just adding reinforcements to all of the body seams. Now we'll continue on around and up the wheel tubs and uh, as you can see we've already went across there and across the whole back and up on the panel here. <laughs> It is a lot of work making sure you get all these seams, but it's gonna be totally worth it. I have to keep gratifying it to myself because this is a lot of work and it's totally gonna be worth it in the end. I hope. <laughs> welded and make sure you join us next time when we install a 15 gallon fuel cell from our friends over at Jegs. So that being said, we'll see you on the next one. <laughs>